The same two people who were sent to the hospital the night of 17 year old Denasia Uzzle's death are now being charged in connection to her death with accessory to commit manslaughter. It's something Uzzle's family has been waiting to hear for months, and there was evidence of that inside the courthouse with a few emotional outbursts as friends and family of Denasia, affectionately called Nay, showed up by the dozens wearing pink, her favorite color and shouting justice for Nay. But there was a presence for the defendants too. 40-year-old Erica Cherry and her son, 19-year-old Nishan Cherry, both separately appeared in court. Nishan pled guilty, but Erica didn't enter a plea. They are both facing charges of accessory to commit manslaughter, accessory to commit strangulation, and more. New London police say this all comes after they got a call on Saturday, April 15th, just after 3 a.m. for an unresponsive woman at a home near Jefferson Ave and Buchanan Road. When they got there, they found Uzzle, who did not have a pulse. She was taken to the hospital where she was pronounced dead. Erica and Naishan Cherry were also found in the home with non-life-threatening stab wounds. Tonight, Uzzle's family is taking in their first step to justice. A relief, a big relief. We want this day to come. And we want them to do time, you know, so you can't do this to anyone's child. You can't. And I don't want to happen to anybody else's child. Now, both Erica and Nishan Cherry had their bond set at $250,000. Both will be back in court at Part A on October 18th, and we'll continue to follow up with this story. We're in New London tonight. Julia LeBlanc, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.